Saturday Night Live's post-election episode aired just 12 hours after Joe Biden was officially declared the president-elect. CNN projects Joe Biden will become the 46th president of the United States. The cold open began with Beck Bennett as Wolf Blitzer and Alex Muffet as John King. My fingers are nubs, but I think that's normal. Two CNN hosts who spend hours and hours of the long election week pointing out vote projections on a map. Jim Carrey returned as Victor Joe Biden as he took the stage in Wilmington, Delaware for his victory speech. I'm going to be a president for all Americans. That's right. Whether you're from a liberal state like California or a conservative state like Oklahoma or a cracked out hot mess like Florida, <laughs> I will be your president. Biden's speech, in reality, aired just three hours before SNL's cold open went to broadcast. I'll work as hard for those who didn't vote for me as those who did. Maya Rudolph returned as Vice President-elect Kamala Harris. The first black. <laughs> the first Indian American. <laughs> Biracial vice president. Yeah. And if any of that terrifies you, well, I don't give a funt. She talked about her historic win and spoke directly to the little girls watching her. And to all the little black and brown girls watching right now, I just want to say this. The reason your mom is laughing so much tonight is because she's drunk. Every little girl watching tonight sees that this is a country of possibilities. Blitzer interrupted Biden and Harris's stage time to hear from President Trump, played by Alec Baldwin, who spoke about the, quote, rigged election. Good evening. Thank you. Thank you for coming to watch my victory speech tonight. But we all know this election was rigged. Just look at the map. There was no blue wave. It was a red wave across the whole country. Show them the map, Kaylee. See? So much red, so much red. Uh, sorry, this is the COVID map. Baldwin headed off the stage to take to a piano, where he played a slowed-down version of the village people's Macho Man, one of Trump's rally songs. I've got to be a macho man. This was a callback to SNL's sketch after Trump was elected in 2016, where Kate McKinnon played a defeated Hillary Clinton. If the minor fall and the major lift, the baffled king composing hallelujah. Dave Chappelle was the host of that 2016 episode. You know, uh, I didn't know that Donald Trump was going to win the election. I did suspect it. Seemed like Hillary was doing well in the polls, and yet, I know the whites. He returned to deliver the opening monologue this year, bringing Trump's presidency full circle. I would implore everybody who's celebrating the day to remember, it's good to be a humble winner. Remember when I was here four years ago? Remember how bad that felt? Remember that half the country right now still feels that way. 